as a scheme member, how to log in and manage EMPF settings, and update MPF account information on the EMPF platform. You can log into the EMPF web portal, retrieve the username and EMPF ID, reset the password easily if you forgot, and update the personal particulars of your EMPF and MPF accounts. How to log into EMPF web portal. First, please visit www.empf.org.hk and click register. Log in EMPF on the right hand corner. Then, select the member tab and choose one way to log in. You can log in using your EMPF username and password, EMPF ID and password, or I am smart. To log in using EMPF username or EMPF ID with your password, you can first select the respective option and enter your username or ID, followed by your password. You will receive a one-time passcode in your registered email address or mobile phone number for verification. Alternatively, you can log into I am Smart mobile app and use the QR code scanner function to scan the QR code shown on your computer web page and follow the instructions. How to retrieve your username and EMPF ID if you forgot. On the EMPF login page, simply click forgot username or forgot EMPF ID under the respective login method. Then you can verify your identity through I am smart or two-factor authentication. To verify by I am smart, please log into I am smart mobile app and use the QR code scanner function to scan the QR code shown on your computer web page and follow the instructions. To use two-factor authentication, fill in your English and Chinese full name, date of birth, Hong Kong ID number, and your registered email address or mobile phone number. Then click send one-time passcode. Enter the verification code sent to your selected contact method. Then, your EMPF username and EMPF ID have been successfully retrieved. Please use the username or EMPF ID shown on your computer web page to log in. How to reset your EMPF password if you forgot? On the EMPF login page, simply click Forgot Password. Then you can verify your identity through I am Smart or two-factor authentication. To verify by I am Smart, please log in to I am Smart mobile app and use the QR code scanner function to scan the QR code shown on your computer web page and follow the instructions. To use two-factor authentication, fill in your English and Chinese full name, date of birth, Hong Kong ID number, and your registered email address or mobile phone number. Then click send one-time passcode. Enter the verification code sent to your selected contact method. Then, you can set up a new password. Click confirm. And your EMPF password has been successfully reset. Please use the new password to log into the EMPF platform. How to update personal particulars for your EMPF and MPF accounts. You can update your personal information in both the EMPF and your MPF accounts, such as your contact information. After login, on the menu bar, click My Account and select Profile Management. From there, you can select EMPF Account Management or MPF Account Management to update the respective information. To update your information for EMPF, click EMPF Account Management and scroll down Click Update to edit the information. Please verify your email address or mobile phone number first by clicking Verify to receive the one-time passcode. Enter the verification code sent to your email address or mobile phone number. Click Save when you finished. If your updates trigger the change of your tax residency, please select the applicable option to update your common reporting standard information. According to your updates, upload the supporting documents listed on the screen if applicable. Review the updated information you provided and click Confirm. Read the terms and conditions and click Accept. Then, your request to update EMPF information has been successfully submitted. On the other hand, to update your MPF account information, 
click MPF Account Management. Then, you can select to update the information in your contribution account, Tax Deductible Voluntary Contribution Account, Special Voluntary Contribution Account, and your personal account. Please select an account to update. Click Update to edit the information. Remember to click Save and follow the subsequent steps. It is recommended to use the same contact information for both your MPF and MPF accounts since the notifications from the platform will only be sent to the contacts in your EMPF records. Review the updated information you provided, click Submit. Then, your request to update MPF information has been successfully submitted. We hope you found this video helpful. Ready to explore more features on the EMPF platform? Visit our website at www.empf.org.hk now.